Hello, Saka Fed. Hi, I'm Roma and welcome to my kitchen. Today I will be making a quick and easy honey garlic glazed chicken recipe. If you want to see how I make this recipe, keep watching. And don't forget to like, share and subscribe. And hit that notification bell so you never miss an episode. Now let's get cooking. Now these are all the ingredients that we are going to need for our chicken recipe. And the exact amount will be listed in the description bar below. Okay, so you're going to need some chicken. And here I have three pieces of chicken, like three legs. And I have cut them in half. They were marinated overnight in a little bit of soy sauce, garlic powder, and some chicken stock. For the glaze, we are going to use some honey some yellow hot mustard, garlic powder, and some soy sauce. You want to bake your chicken at 400 degrees Fahrenheit. What you want to do now is put these in the pan and leave the skin up. You want to keep the skin up so your chicken is nice and moist. in there so we put it like this and what I'm gonna do next is just put the lid on it and just wait till the oven reaches temperature I'm gonna start making my glaze so what you do you just turn this on and we're gonna put the honey in there so we just want to melt that and you want to keep it on a medium fire don't put it too high because you don't want it to burn now we can just add the garlic and I have some granulated garlic so just put that in you can also use fresh garlic uh, if you would what you would do with that is um, I find this is a lot easier though but with the fresh garlic you would just have to pound it with a little bit of salt the salt will make it form into a pasty consistency so you won't get the chunks and then you can actually use fresh garlic either way it's going to taste good it's going to bring it to a little boil and you can see it's starting to boil so we just give it another stir next i'm going to add some hot yellow mustard It's boiling up and the last ingredient is the soy sauce so you just add that in there just let it boil for a couple minutes and then we're going to turn it off and put it aside see that's it you can use that on fish on salmon it tastes really good and instead of honey you can actually use maple syrup for salmon okay and that should be done you don't want to boil it too much so i would say about three minutes all together after you add your soy sauce and then we're just going to turn it off and look at that that's your glaze oven is ready so i'm just going to put it in and we are going to leave it for 45 minutes So the water for my rice is ready and just gonna put it in. I'm gonna put one of these Goya Saison in there. This is gonna give it a nice rich yellow color. I'm washing the kale and if you notice I added vinegar to the water a little extra cleaning so that's why I put the vinegar in there and I'm just gonna let it sit there for a little bit
ketchup. Chicken, see how it's coming. Oh yeah, all right. I think it's time to glaze. What I'm gonna do is drain out some of this fat before I add my glaze on there. See, they're nice and cooked. This is when we put the glaze. Okay, I'm just giving it a stir. Look at that. It's gonna look very good and taste good too. So I'm getting my brush. And we're just gonna brush it on. Put some on now and then put it back in the oven. We are not going to cover it. See, on there, we're going to put it. And at the top, on the top rack. And we're going to leave it for 10 minutes. And then we can add a little bit more. Okay. So you see this, oh, look at that. We're going to add the rest of our glaze. going to put it on the top rack okay back on the rack and that's it leave it and we'll just check it after 10 minutes and hopefully it's done by then let's check the chicken I can't wait oh yeah it's sizzling up oh look at that perfect perfectly glazed chicken smells so good okay guys i'm gonna try this looking good smelling good of course i'm gonna taste the chicken it's perfectly seasoned mm -hmm. that is so good and here you have it guys our delicious honey garlic chicken Thank you for watching and we'll see you again next time.